Shields, coach, if you want to throw out an open second. You know, I'm really proud of our basketball team, total team effort tonight. Uh, starting to get guys a little more comfortable uh, with role definition, although we're not to that point just yet. As I, you and I have talked, I mean, it may be 10, 12 games into it before we have a true rotation with so many new guys. But excited about our team from the standpoint that we're growing as far as being a part of something bigger than, our, than ourselves and not caring who gets the credit. I mean, the other night, Tad plays nine minutes. Dillard plays 29 minutes. I mean, it's a different guy every night. I think that's what, what depth is about. This team has more depth than what we had last year. When they cut that lead to six points, I mean, what's going through your mind? Kind of a younger team, you know, obviously. You know, we, no, we've no, got no. to handle adversity. Yeah, yeah. And that's part of the, the growing process as a young team. I thought we handled adversity in a very positive way tonight. They got out to 11-5 start in the yeah. second half. After we had a 15-point halftime lead, we talked about the first four minutes being important to the start of the second half. And, uh, they beat us to some effort plays. And they drove the ball right there. But I thought the last 12 minutes of the game, I thought we had some some championship plays. And when I'm talking about championship plays, I'm talking about being really diving on the fourth yeah. floor, losing balls, and those 50-50 yeah. plays, getting on the offensive plays, making the extra pass, yeah. some takes. Is that what you're looking for in those situations? Just some someone to do do something like that to kind of maybe turn it a little bit for you guys? Well, you've got to have guys make plays, yeah. and that's part of the guys making plays. And they've got to make plays within the structure of it. Not guys running off there, guys trying to double and giving up a wide open three on a reversal. So that's yeah. what you don't want. There's got to be within the framework. Yeah. Your guys are starting to cry. And with Taggart, like you were saying, I mean, he goes to play, you know, he was starting, he played nine minutes the other night. Was that just kind of, you know, kind of trying no, to figure out that rotation? No, the first thing, it was he got his third foul. Oh, that's right, yeah, okay, yeah, 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 he was, yeah, okay, so that was part of it. dealt with fouls, and yeah. uh, it also dealt with Leroy mm -hmm. taking some of those minutes for yeah, okay. the assignment on air. Yeah, <clears throat> but like what you saw from Tag in the first half, you know, I mean, he, he, he threw him out there and, and plays pretty well, and then the second right. half he got a couple steals and that three-point play. Well, and, and you good. think about it. Yeah. When a guy starts playing well yeah. like that, he, his minutes yeah. 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 Um, And then the rebounding, I think it was. I think you had 19 offensive rebounds, you know, plus 13. Obviously a message you got, you you probably have sent to them here the last couple days. It was so, much right? better. Yeah. We, we had 15 offensive rebounds at the half. We were up 15 on the class. Didn't feel like we rebounded as well in the second half as we did in the first half, but uh, was really encouraged by our guys sharing the basketball too. Um, still have some growth uh, to have with you know decision making down there late and some decisions where we didn't run the clock like we need to, but that's part of having freshman guards and young basketball team will continue to grow in that area. Uh, it seemed like, like I asked them, you know, kind of before those last, you know, kind of minute or so when it was in hand, it seemed like you guys have closed pretty well here in the games you've played here. I mean, that's a positive sign, obviously. And what's that kind of due to? I mean, just is there any one particular thing you can point to? Or? Well, I, I think first and foremost is guys yeah. getting our, our circle tight. Yeah. I mean, that comes with yeah. familiarity, yeah. guys playing together and that sort of thing. You know, I, I didn't think last week our circle was very tight. Yeah. I thought we had some individual play about us. And I think our guys have, have continued to grow in that area. And that will be an ongoing process. Yeah. Yeah. And, and early on, maybe it's probably more likely to come at home first and then do it on the road. That's the next step. Oh, right? with, yeah. that, with a young team. Yeah. I mean, you know, I think back to a couple of years ago, the year we had Fowler and mm -hmm. uh, Edwards and, yeah. and Brandon Patterson, those seniors, the year we won 23, we had 14 true road games, and we were 11 and 3 in true road games. But that was a, an right. experienced, older team. Yeah. Uh, that wasn't a group of eight freshmen. Right. Yeah. Thanks, Coach.